话。Hey kids, Mo the Monster here. Today we're going to play a movie in Quartz Composer. What we need to do is generate an image and then render it somewhere. So first, we'll grab a generator. We'll take the image with movie patch, drag and drop it into our editor. Next, we'll scroll down to the renderers, drag a billboard. This is going to give us a nice 2D surface, nothing fancy. We'll take the image node from the movie, connect it to the image node on the billboard. Well, now we're connected up properly, but we're not going to see anything in our viewer because there's nothing actually inside of this image with movie patch. What we could do is manually enter in a path here in the movie path, point that to a specific movie on our hard drive, or make it easy on us. We can drag and drop a movie from anywhere on our computer into the editor. Quartz Composer will create one of these guys here, but it'll give it a nice name. It'll enter in the correct path. We're ready to go. So I'll drag this new image node to the billboard. It will automatically replace the old connection I had. And now in our viewer, you can see our movie playing. However, it's only taking up half the screen. If we hover over the billboard, we can see that the width is 1. Now that may sound like it would take up the whole screen, but this is the way the Quartz Composer deals with its coordinates. The left side of the screen is minus 1, the middle is 0, and the right side is plus 1. So the width would have to be 2 to actually stretch all the way from the left hand side to the right hand side. That's easy to fix. We'll click on our billboard and come down to our inspector, go to page 2, and here we can change the width from 1 to 2. Now we take a look in our viewer, we have some nice full screen video. <laughs> 